What's going on, fellas? How the hell are you? This is Alan, and welcome back to the newsroom. Your source for war robots, news, and rumors. All right, guys, got a couple of things to talk about today, all right? And one of them is very important, all right? If you thought we had good news yesterday, today is even a hell of a lot better, all right? Uh, one thing I do want to cover real quick, it was brought to my attention. I didn't even know uh, when we opened it up, but the operations, guys, is only 10 days long, okay? Uh, I've already kind of trucked through it. I'm at level 25. I will not make any kind of purchase, all right, until I complete all 50. Otherwise, it's not worth the purchase, okay? So that's just a little tip for tech so you could go ahead and check that out. So if you're working on it, you got to move, guys, all right? You got to grind. Uh, you blow through the levels really, really fast. Uh, in a day and four hours, all right, I've already accumulated up to level 25. So they do go really, really quick. Now, let's get to the meat of what we're talking about. And we're going to go over to the Reddit page, guys. And we're going to read what Artemi had to say regarding the drones this is great news okay so we have the state of remastered and we have uh the plant features and all this other stuff and that's all well and good okay but that's not why we're here you can go over to the reddit you can read all this good stuff that they got they're basically talking about how uh the game is a little bit too big at uh two gigs uh but they're working on certain things we've had crashes all right but they've been working on that as well uh they got all kinds of neat little stuff planned out I don't want to go over the state of the game, and I do not want to go over the plant features. Y'all can jump on there. What I do want to be going over, guys, is the drones. We're going to blow this up, and we're going to scroll across. <clears throat> we got lots of feedback on drones. We agree that some of the drone mechanics put a huge shadow on the feature. We are preparing a big rough, a big round of tweaks for the drones to make them more affordable and approachable, okay? Drones, power cells. Drone power cell deployment will be removed, okay? So now we ain't gonna pay no power source, power, power source. <laughs> we're not gonna drop any, I just gotta work, don't be judging me, all right? We're not gonna be paying any power cells to drop the drone into battle. That is a huge plus, all right? You will be able to spawn uh, every drone for zero power cells, period. That's great, all right? Uh, because if you notice, and I'm gonna do it in free for all a little bit, you're gonna notice where the power cells as you drop the same drone over and over again, the price goes up, okay? Uh, randomized drone uh, energy capacity. All new drones will come with maximum possible power capacity. By default, existing drones will be, dumped, will be bumped up to maximum capacity, okay? And if you didn't know, guys, you could get, let's say, the Nebula, and one of them might have 32 slots of power cells, our energy cells, our energy slots, another one might have 28, okay? So it just kind of varied. There was too much uh, inconsistency, all right, when it came to the drones as far as how many uh, energy slots you were going to get, all right? So the fact that they're going to set it at a fix and everybody's going to get the same across the board is a big thumbs up. More microchips. Daily task consists of microchips. Rewards will start appearing in your in your task log so now we're going to be able to pick up micro, microchips on the daily all right as far as with, with the daily task that's a good thing i hope they don't plan on removing the gold got to leave the gold there this has got to be an added plus okay uh more good microchips t3 microchips will start appearing in the chip store certain certain rate of chips will also have a higher chance of appearing we publish the list once the update goes live, okay? Cheaper microchips in the store. Microchips store refresh costs will be greatly reduced. 50 for the first refresh of the day, 100 for the second, 200 for the uh, 100 for the second, and 200 for all uh, the ones after that, okay? So it's not going to keep increasing after 200. It's just going to stay at 200. I would recommend do your first flip. All right, or check the store, use your video ad, and wait till the following day before you decide to do it again. Save your gold, guys. Balance change. Status of effects, eight type microchips will be tuned down, which is good, okay? Because as I was saying in yesterday's video, it seems like every five seconds you get locked down or suppressed or something of that nature. It was just too overbearing, way too much. There were a lot of complaints of the meta breaking effect, so we're addressing this directly. 
And they're doing all this really, really fast, guys. They didn't wait six months to get data on this. They got the, the early information and they acted on it right away. So I'm real happy to see that. One more entirely positive tweak, okay? Chip power progression curve will be adjusted. T1, T2 getting slightly weaker. Uh, details will be part available. Details uh, on this will be, on this part will be available on this weekend's test server, okay? So we'll make sure we check that out. All these changes will go online next week. There will be a separate announcement on everything ready for, uh, on everything that is ready. Stay tuned. Okay, there's one part I'm missing here. Let me go back and check this out. Okay, here it is. The chip merging, guys. Better control for chip merging. Fusing 15 microchips of the same uh, name will give you the same microchip with a higher tier. That is about the best thing that I've seen. Those of y'all that have, were combining microchips like I did earlier, okay, and whatever chip you got was going to be a random chip. So if you traded in 15 lockdowns, okay, then you were going to get something random. You were not going to get a lockdown. I like this a whole lot better. Uh, it's going to make it a lot more enticing, all right, to do a conversion than to go and convert. Say you waste all that gold picking up those chips, all right, and then you get something entirely different than what you wanted. So the fact that they're going to have a better control over the chip merging so what you trade in is what you're going to get thumbs up on that okay now we can come over here and go over this real quick if you all want to take a look at it there's a list of player suggestions compiled available on the subreddit this is really good we are incredibly thankful for the innovator and we'll be refreshing that list from the from time to time worth worth nothing that that there are some things that are bound to never happen so this section will be called ruled out. Now, of course, we've gone over the ruled out before, guys, and there were ideas that we've had that we liked that apparently got ruled out, like the reload button, all right? Everybody seemed to have liked the reload button, but it didn't make the cut. So things like that that are going to be ruled out, you're going to be able to go in there and check it out to see uh, if something that you like has already been eliminated, okay? Okay. Overhaul, we are planning on uh, migrating from the old third-party tech to our own custom-built server solution. But this subject is for another story. But this subject for another story. I'm assuming they're saying that's for another day. And much more, but we'll keep us busy for the next year. Let's talk about something more. That's what we're going to go down to the drones. Uh, here, I'll go ahead and blow this up. Y'all can screenshot it, read it if you want to. They're just talking about uh, the state of the remastered and where they're at right now, okay? So let's go ahead and uh, pause out of here. And the other day, when we talked about the crashing, okay, they set out, they put out a fix, and it, it turned out to be one of the video ad uh, servers that they had was creating a, a problem, okay? They went ahead and turned that off. There, I played all day yesterday. There were no crashes at all. So I'm real happy about that. They're making their adjustments really quick, really fast. You know, the day, the times of, of us waiting weeks and months for something to happen seems to be going by the wayside. So if this is a, a, a sign of things to come, they're doing a really, really, really good job, okay? On the drones, uh, my initial input is everything that they put down, I like, all right? I like it all. There's nothing in there that they put that I have an issue with. Drop your drones in for free, Okay. Uh, better control as far as what you're going to get for your trade-ins. All of it, guys. All of that is, is good stuff. The drones turned off a lot of people, okay? I mean, it, it really frustrated a lot of people. Uh, the fact that they're going to tune these chips down a little bit, where we're not going to be getting suppressed and locked down and frozen every two to three seconds is a plus, all right? That needs to be like the way they have it right now. After so many shots, I think that once you got... Lockdown, suppressed, or or uh, are frozen, right? You should have immunity for at least 10 to 15 seconds after that. You can't be getting locked down every five seconds. It makes the game stagnant. So hopefully whatever adjustments they make, they're good. And if they need to make more adjustments, 
You got to make sure you put your feedback in, boys, all right? Without feedback, they don't know what's going on. They're, they're gauging it by what you guys are saying. Open your tickets. Let them know what's going on in the game. Give them your concerns, all right? That's what the help uh, is, is there for, right? When you go, to, you go to the settings, you go to the help, in-game help, and that's where you fill out your ticket, all right? If you got issues with the game, let them know, all right? Uh, this is some of the best news I've had this week, all right? Other than them bringing Platinum in back into my uh, beloved operations, I'm glad to see that, all right? Uh, give me your comments in the comment section below. I will be giving you a password. We are also doing the giveaway. Make sure you're paying attention, all right? Here we go, boys. Let's get this ball rolling. Give me a little bit of that. Give me this. Give me that. Uh-huh. Uh, yep. Are we ready to go? All right, guys. And we are still in search. Coming up on the two-minute mark. All right. Uh, this is going to be one subject I think they need to cover as far as the wait times. Uh, especially if we're going to be running boosters. All right. If the wait times are, are going to be longer because they're trying to pair us up against uh, somebody that's more equal to our hanger, I'm down for that. I can wait. I don't have an issue to wait two minutes, two and a half minutes to find an evenly matched game. Give me everybody that's MK212 and, and, and maxed out last stands and maxed out everything. That's what I want to be going up against. That's where I'm at, and that's who I need to be fighting, okay? Uh, but we cannot be burning our boosters while we're in search, okay? So they need to do something to tweak that, all right? Instead of having 30 minutes worth of boosters, maybe when you click on a booster, it's good for four or five games all right something to that nature uh where we don't have to worry about a time a time length all right it's good for certain amount of matches i think five games would be good uh maybe four games would be good somewhere in there okay uh that's just a thought i have y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below we are breaching the three minute mark i'm going to put this in pause i'll go ahead and let y'all know once we get ready to drop into a match exactly how long that time frame was all right, guys, as soon as I paused it, we found a match. Let's get in here. Can't see him. Ah, they're getting better at this. Little peekaboo. Uh oh, don't see that. Oh, nice try, nice try, nice try. You're not my favorite person right now. This is for you, but he's trying to steal my stuff. So I'm coming after you. We're going to redirect our fight over here, and then we'll go back to the Falcon. All right. Come here, Pudge Rock. I'm, I'm gonna have to hurt you. I'm gonna have to hurt you. All right, uh, let's get uh, the scorpion in. And I believe that that's that, that's that falcon. He's still there. Hit some point. So we were having a conversation before we were so rudely interrupted. And that's what that's what we're talking about right there. You know what? We're ready for this fight. Let's last stand him. We're gonna keep walking across. I'm not gonna go back. There it is. All right. We're gonna take our shots away and get the hell out of there. He's got way too thick skin for us to be sitting there and just trading punches with him. But well, we will take a piece of this guy right here.
Ah. Oh. Maybe this was not the best of ideas. Yep, that's gonna keep happening. I'm gonna keep get, getting those kills stolen. Okay, we need to get a full reload. So we're gonna wait it out a little bit. Actually, we're gonna let these boys fight it out for a little while. I'm gonna come over here and mess around with uh, enemy number four. Too soon, Junior. My turn. All right. Let's see if we can come over here and get still. No, we're not. Too far. Oh, you can hold out for a little bit longer. Uh, look, look at his heels go up, man. We're out of here. the Hawking. And you can see where the power cells on the wall have already gone up to 60. God, that, he's got some seriously thick skin. Wow. Let's just get inside this thing so we get full on. Nope, he's going to get underneath. Another loss. Wow. Good job. Uh, we're gonna stay with the hawk. Should have brought the pursuer in. I didn't think about the pursuer. Let's just mark him. He'll drop, and we'll back off. Hawk again. I mean, not the hawk, the, the, the falcon. All right, guys, password's gonna be. Wasp, all right? It's one of the drones. It's the drone I'm using right now. 
It's actually what the one I like the most. So we're gonna go ahead and use that. So take the, the password, hashtag it, player ID and platform, and you are eligible for the giveaway. Another death. Wow, man. I'm, we're going to have to call police on this one. I've been robbed so many times this game is disgusting. What the hell are you shooting me for, dude? Check it out. Nice. All right, where's Burpee Sewer? And... Actually, I shouldn't even drop the drone. I didn't need to drop the drone. Now it's 20 seconds left. And that's going to bring an end to it. All right, guys. Once again, y'all hit me up in the comment section. Give me, let me know what your thoughts are on the drones. Uh, personally, I love it. I love everything about what they're about to do as far as that. Uh, as far as any other changes that they got coming up, as soon as we get that information, we will bring it to you. We know we got a good test server coming up this weekend, so we will be on top of it and bringing you all the action. All right, guys, you have the password. You know what to do with it. All right. Uh, we've been going through this for the last, uh, what, 13, 14 days. Uh, we are rounding the bend. Uh, giveaways are almost over, but no stress, boys. All right, we got more giveaways that are going to be coming. So if you're new to the channel, hit the sub button, all right? Also hit that bell for notifications so that you'll be aware if and when we do the giveaways and when we have the uploads and the newsrooms and the gameplay and all that good stuff, all right? And if you did like this video, guys, knock the hell out of the like. I really do appreciate it, and it does help me out. And until we talk again, boys and girls, this is Islander. Signing out.